other than the president, the deputy president, and the retired presidents, no other Kenyans are entitled by the law to be provided with the personal security detail. In case of Honorable Justice Mukambi, the two security officers in question are general duty officers and they are, were therefore recalled to attend VIP protect, protection security training and also were replaced by two VIP protection officers also to ensure that we have a way forward to ensure that we reduce and address the road carnage, losing of life on our roads across the country that has been on the increase in the recent past. On, on the alleged limitation of the Honorable Justice Lawrence Mukambi, I would like to say that contrary to the allocation by the Judicial Service Commission, Yesterday that the security details assigned to the Honorable Justice Mukambi has been thrown to intimidate the charge. We wish to clarify that allocation were ill-intended. The National Police Service plays a critical role in the national security of our country. Consequently, the independent command and control of police is vested in the Inspector General. Other than the CS interior that may give policy direction to the IG, no person may give direction to the IG with respect to the employment, assignment, promotion, suspension or dismissal of any member of the National Police Service in accordance with Article 245 for Section C of the Constitution. The Inspector General is responsible for the security of all Kenyans. Their starter notwithstanding, however, the Inspector General may accord additional security detail to specific persons based on the nature of assignments being undertaken by such a person and the threat levels which their responsibility may attract. Other than the President, the deputy president and the retired presidents, no other Kenyans are entitled by the law to be provided with the personal security detail. Owing to the role of the judiciary, the National Police Service recently established the Judicial Police Unit purposely for protection of the judiciary and its officials. In addition, the protection of VIPs is guided by the National Police policy, National Police Service policy, on the provision of protection of security to VIPs and other state officers. And VIPs are protected by officers drawn from specialized unit, including security of government buildings and VIP protection unit SGB. The requisite protection to all government buildings, judiciary included, and their staff therein, remain our priority and we do serve without favor or discrimination. That notwithstanding, police officers seconded to all government institutions remain serving officers of National Police Service and their deployment or reassignment remain the mandate of the Inspector General of Police. In case of Honorable Justice Mukambi, the two security officers in question are general duty officers and they are, were therefore recalled to attend VIP protect, protection security training and also were replaced by two VIP protection officers from the Judicial Police Unit. Responsibility of the IG to secure the nation is humongous task and Police work is unique. It is in the public domain that at the time the Inspector General was summoned to appear in court, he was actively involved in security assessment in the coast and northeastern regions in compliance with the duties that are assigned to him. And with that, I end my statement.
thank you for coming. Also, I want to thank you for finding time to come. Also, <coughs> assist us. I would like also to call upon other stakeholders like NTSA, like the Matatu Sarkos, the general public, and the fourth estate, the media, to assist us also to capping the road carnage that has been happening in this across the country because we want to have people to live and live well. Lives should not be cut short just because of some other incidents that could have been avoided. Not forgetting the county government also to ensure that we have the parking areas, we have the bus stop areas and stages so that the pedestrian as well may have their way to live. Thank you. May God bless you guys. Very quick, quick question. Very quick question, sir. Uh, maybe the redeployment or recalling and redeployment of the resources. Negative. It is not a unique one. He was not the only officer who are called. There are many officers. It's only that you might not be privy to that. But the fact is that it is normal for officers to be taken to VIP protection causes and also change of things. They were not recalled that he, did, he remained without security. They were replaced immediately. So that was just an ill-intended cause of alarm. Thank you. We just want to know the numbers of deaths. You've talked about corruption. Thank you very much. On the figures uh, of the deaths and accidents and those vehicles involved, you will get after this. Uh, on the issue of Rossi, other Co question? Uh, corruption. You, you mentioned on the issue of corruption, the, we've taken significant measures by ensuring we have the administrative actions taken, officers are appearing within our system of administrative, that is order room proceedings and so forth. Also, ensuring we relieve them traffic duties to other areas, as well as they wait their last or the outcome of the administrative issue or action that is being taken. Any matter before court is not discussed. Thank you. Mambo yaliyo kotini hatuongei kwa mitandao asandeni. Mambo ya kodi